mystery of stuff. Things can sometimes be frozen in time, and this is exactly what this family found in their newly purchased house in France. They were the first to open a hidden room locked 102 years ago. Watch till the end and tell us what you think about it in the comments section below the video. Our planet Earth is massive, and many of its parts are still undiscovered and untouched by people or time. Once we enter these places, we get a fantastic glimpse of the past. It seems that time had stopped centuries ago, leaving everything intact. No progress, no motion, nothing. And this is one of the places in question, a place that gives you a sense of nostalgia and transports you back in time. In a quiet village in France called Bellebre, a family decided to buy this modest looking house. However, they were greeted by an unusual surprise. At a glance, the lot seemed to have the characteristics of a mid-19th century home with so many rooms and long hallways. From the outside, the new owners could see some windows which were nowhere to be seen from the inside. So they decided to investigate the matter, realizing that there was a hidden room with no entrance. It was walled up with bricks more than a hundred years ago. Of course, the new owner's curiosity urged them to open the mysterious room and find out why it was closed all this time. However, what really caught their interest was what was inside that room. After dismantling the brick wall, the new owners traveled back in time and locked eyes with the house's first owner. It was the bedroom of the French Army Lieutenant Hubert Rousseau, with his photograph hanging on the wall, ready to greet whoever enters the room. Hence, they later found out that Hubert served in the Dragoons Cavalry Regiment in World War I to die later in Belgium on April 26, 1918. Hubert was initially buried in a British cemetery, but was moved to a graveyard of his hometown village of Belbre in 1922 and awarded a Medal of Courage in battle after his death. Seemingly, the parents couldn't forget the loss of their dear son and decided to leave everything that belonged to him untouched. They sealed the room's door with brick a wall to prevent anyone from getting inside and messing with their son's latest touches to this world. They kept everything exactly how Hubert had it 102 years ago, before leaving the house for the last time and heading to the front. The lieutenant's family later made a promise that they would never, under any pretext, enter this room. After 13 years later, more precisely in 1935, the Roucher family had to move and leave Belbe, giving their house to the French General Eugene Brudeau. On one condition, no soul should touch the room for at least 500 years. Brudeau, in turn, promised that the room would never get opened as long as he was breathing. However, events took another turn as World War II began in 1939. Eugene's promise couldn't be kept and Hubert's bedroom wasn't under supervision anymore. France fell to the onslaught of the German army, and General Brudet began to assist the appointed German government in holding a high position since 1940. At the end of the war, Brudet escaped to Spain in fear of punishment, only to be arrested there in 1955 and was sentenced to death. After that, the authorities seized the property and put it up for sale. Surprisingly, it was purchased by his granddaughter and her husband, Daniel Fabre. Remembering her grandfather's promise and the Rousseau's family's request, they didn't dare to approach the sealed room. The couple had lived in the house for almost 70 years before Daniel passed away in 2014. A whole generation grew up there, but no one ever entered the secret room. Since then, the house didn't have any owners until 2020 when this family bought it at an auction, without knowing anything about the legacy of the sacred room that lasted for 102 years, they opened it without giving it a second thought. However, what they saw inside left them speechless. All the items in the room were real artifacts. They somehow reflected the life story of the lieutenant. Time had stopped here a long time ago. One of the most captivating items is Hubert Rousseau's portrait that hangs on the wall and is welcoming the new owners. The 110-year-old drawings and books are still scattered on the table, alongside his medals. Once you take a look at his still-made bed, you find the Order of the Legion of Honor laid intact. In addition to the military cross and the photographs of his friends, 
However, not everything was left untouched, as some of his clothes had been eaten by moths, including his old uniform, which is in the same place Hubert left it. Interestingly, there's a bottle with earth that was put on the table. The inscription on it says, the earth of Flanders in which our dear child fell and which kept his remains for four years. These weren't all. An old Calvary sword still hangs on the wall. Even the chair on which he once sat is intact. There are also many fascinating antiques on the table, such as a candlestick, ashtray, old photographs, and knives. Besides many books and two pairs of Hubert's boots, old watches and pistols from the late 19th century, and even cigars, and many more impressive and rare things that were observed. According to the new owners, when you go inside this mysterious room, you feel that its owner just got out, and you should return soon. Fortunately, although, they're not intending on changing anything in Hubert's bedroom. They don't think that keeping it closed is a wise choice either. Instead, they plan on transforming it into a museum in memory of Hubert Rochot, thus sharing a piece of long-forgotten history with the world. Local officials appreciated the new owner's decision. They said that no matter how much they'd want to continue the 102-year-old tradition, the family members are the legal owners of the property and have all the right to do whatever they like with it. The room is a time portal that gives you the opportunity to see the whole world a century before. Entering the room, you won't be able to just see it, but to touch it and feel it, you'll be able to live in it. Well. If you were to discover such a valuable and genuine find, what would you do with it? Did you enjoy today's story? Let us know what you think about it in the comments. If you believe this story was amazing, don't hesitate to share it with your buddies, hit the subscribe button, and activate the notification bell so you never miss your daily dose of incredible stories.